Police say a woman was kidnapped from Charlotte's Arboretum Shopping Center. Now they say she was helping her grandmother get into their car after lunch, and that man with the gun swooped in. And the Arboretum is a busy place, always filled with families and shoppers, people grabbing lunch. Our Damani Lewis is out there tonight, and Damani, this woman was then driven into South Carolina from there. Well, Scott, this is a very scary story here. All of this happening around 3:30 afternoon in the afternoon on a Friday. On a Friday, now police say the victim was actually taken at gunpoint to South Carolina. Now it all started right here in the parking lot of Arboretum here. Investigators say, and you can see right now, there are a lot of people out here shopping, getting ready for the holidays. Many of them stunned to hear these new, to hear this news. Now, police sources tell us a woman was eating with her grandmother here, and when she pulled the car around to pick the grandmother up, and that's when she was approached by the suspect at gunpoint and kidnapped in her own car from the parking lot. Now, sources say she was taken to South Carolina, abandoned there. Then police say the suspect took her car and robbed someone else at the Independence Boulevard Walmart. For shoppers here at the Arboretum, they say they can't believe something like this happened in a very busy place. I'm shocked, absolutely shocked. I feel super safe here. Um, I live right in this area. Um, no shopkeepers, no people that work here and I'm shocked. Now, what makes this even scarier? Investigators say that the victim did not know the suspect in all of this, and police say the suspect still may be driving the victim's car. Now, we're working with police to see if we can get more uh, information on the suspect, possible a suspect description of that car, and get a little bit more information. We'll continue to follow the story. Let's send it back to you. Yeah, Damani, everybody's out and about just kind of taking care of their business before the holidays, and you don't think to look for someone with a gun. Scary story.